Heidi ho, Heidi ho, Heidi ho. This is the pool we inherited with our property. And when we bought the property several years ago, our kids were too young really to be in the pool, so we weren't comfortable with it. And then, and we took care of it, of course. And then when we were ready to open the pool, because we thought, okay, they can swim, this will be cool, it'll be nice. Uh, the liner tour, that's the liner. We've been tearing it up a little bit more, as you can see, to get it out of the pool. So this has been going on for years. We had the, the fence posts already in. My husband was going to build the fence. We got the wood over there. That wood's been sitting there for I don't even know how many years at this point. Um, so I'm still planning on using that wood to make the fence. But this is what we're going to be tackling. And this is going to take you know well into next year to do. So the goal for this year, for this summer season going into fall, is just to clean this mess up. Um, you can see that over in the far corner. I, you know, he thinks it's vermiculite, a vermiculite mix. I was in there for several hours yesterday. There's a whole bunch of sand in there. So, it, and it looks like there was patchwork done or something. So it might be a combination of all kinds of stuff going on. But what I'm thinking we're going to end up doing is sand. But I'm not really sure. So this season, it's about getting the liner out of the pool. Um, we've got some that's just stuck in just dredge, drudge, icky stuff down there at the bottom there. We had a heck of time with that. When I say we, my son was helping me try and get that out. There were some giant spiders in this pool too. I was not happy about that. So we're going to get that out of there. We're going to clean up this mess. Then we're going to buy a new pool cover because we don't have one anymore because it got a hole in it. Actually, it got a couple holes in it from animals getting to it. Um, and then we're going to cover the pool. And then next year, we'll tackle... Yet one more thing with this pool, and it'll probably be the floor, the walls, obviously, and dealing with that. So if you've ever been in this particular scenario and did not want to fill in your pool, because I really don't want to do that, that just makes me sad, give me a message in the comments. Let me know how you would tackle this. What would you do? What kinds of resources do you, would you suggest I, I utilize in order to get this pool functioning again? I'm assuming the mechanical, mechanical plumbing stuff still works don't really know yet at this point uh, but you know I figure if we tackle it a little bit at a time we'll be able to get it done and eventually have a, a swimming pool we can use again stairs aren't too bad they're a little squishy on this end they're a little squishy but I saw a YouTube video about how to fix that so I'm ready for that one at any rate this is the project that we've got going forward besides all the other projects we're working on but this one we're just gonna tackle like I said cleaning this out and then covering it with pool cover. See you later. Thumbs up on this one. Not really. Not yet. See ya.